man captures eerie footage while out alone on Lake Superior. In October 2016, Jason, who lives in Michigan, was out on Lake Superior filming a music video. For the freelance videographer and YouTuber, a trip to the most northern of the Great Lakes was just a perk of the job. As Jason captured footage of a rainbow, a shot perfect for the My Michigan music video, which commemorated some of the state's most beautiful views, he happened upon something else on the horizon. It was something he couldn't quite make out. Pulling the camera away from the rainbow, Jason trained his focus to the horizon where the mysterious shape appeared. Once focused, he couldn't believe his eyes. What he saw was positively ghostly. Jason wondered about the object on the YouTube video he uploaded later. Was it a UFO? He asked. It certainly looked like it. But Jason decided it was something else, a ghost ship, and it was easy to see why. According to Jason, the figure was bobbing on the water and moving with the crest of waves and currents. A UFO probably wouldn't do that, and neither would a big oil rig. Jason told CNN that he watched the ghost ship bob on the horizon for 90 minutes before it simply vanished into thin air. Had he truly witnessed a ghostly visitor on a voyage from the other side? While Lake Superior may be known for its picturesque beauty, it wasn't so kind to ships and sailors over the years. More than 6,000 ships have wrecked on its waters. For instance, this ship rests just below the surface of Lake Superior. Still, not everyone bought Jason's ghost ship theory. Some thought the figure in the video was actually more divine. That's right, the video caught on in some pious circles, and people believed the figure was Jesus Christ himself. That conclusion made sense, too, at least for the religiously inclined. They argued the figure resembled the Son of God, dressed in the customary garb, and holding his staff, the Bachelisu as he crested the waves. Had Jason witnessed some sort of miracle? The news network surmised that Jason had actually filmed the Granite Island Lighthouse, a 19th century structure that was 8 miles off the coast. Looking at the lighthouse, you can see it shared the shape of the once believed ghost ship. But that didn't explain everything. Jason had said he watched the figure bob up and down on the horizon for 90 minutes. If you watch the footage, you can make out the gentle rocking with your own eyes. He also said the figure disappeared. How could that be explained? Similar to how the moon appears enormous on the horizon, the distance between Jason and the lighthouse played a role. Mark said that the mind tends to try to make sense out of what our eyes send to our brain. Sometimes, our eyes simply don't get their facts straight. Whatever you believe in your mind, that's what it was, Jason said. That's what life is about, dreaming. So maybe it was a ghost ship on the horizon. Maybe it was Jesus Christ returned. Maybe it was a lighthouse. Wondering, though, was half the fun. Whether you believe in ghosts or not, you have to admit that whatever lurking out there in the heavy fog definitely looks supernatural.